Welcome to SportsLink Replay. I'm Pat Boylan next to Kyle Binder. It was another slow start for the Ball State football team and another good second half. However, they didn't have enough this time as Ball State fell to Liberty 27-23. Ball State shot themselves in the foot just way too many times, Kyle. Eight penalties for 81 yards. You're not going to win football games like that when you get into the red zone five times and you only get one touchdown out of it. You miss a field goal. You have a penalty. Uh, which brought back one of the touchdowns. You're really doing too much for the other team to keep them in the game. And the Ball State Cardinals did too much of that. And Liberty, although a very good team, really got the ball back from the Cardinals and they won the game. There were a couple bright spots, however. Freshman quarterback Keith Wenning came in for Gelly Page right before halftime and played phenomenally. Completed 13 of his 18 passes, threw for a touchdown. It looks like we may be looking at our quarterback of the future. Absolutely. Keith Wenning, you saw all the attributes of a great quarterback. Sam Parrish has... Uh, highly touted this guy from the beginning, and wow, can he throw through a perfect ball to Toriel Gibson at the very end of the game. Could have been the game-winning touchdown, but he dropped it. Uh, tough loss for the Ball State Cardinals, but bright spot Keith Winning for sure. It looks like a bright future is ahead for quarterback Keith Winning. Ball State takes on in-state rival Purdue next Saturday in West Lafayette. For SportsLink Replay, for Kyle Binder, I'm Pat Boylan. Thanks for watching.